Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Hopefully, I am live. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Let's see. I should just double check, right? Yeah. Yeah, I should be live, you guys. I should be live. <clears throat> Let's start. This is a brand new game that I that I started playing personally, but uh, I need to. Uh, I, I wanted to stream it, you guys, because it is such a fun game. I can play for hours. So let's 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 check it out. First, let me double check to see if, it, if everything's correct. Let's see. Yeah, everything's good. Everything's good. So we start off in a town called Fair Haven. Come and have a pre-night snack. I, I I need to change that. Fair Haven town, you guys. That flag, though. I'm having a snack. Estoy comiendo. Para los que estén aquí, perdón. Nuevo juego. Es como Stardew Valley. It's just like Stardew Valley. Aquí vengo yo. Here I come. Ah, me ando comiendo unos chetos. know the way to hazel wilds farm tara oh my goodness it really is you isn't it lena i haven't seen you since i was tiny it's good to see you again i heard Let's you go. were coming to stay with your grandma hazel now do you remember the way <laughs> uh no i don't remember much from that time no problem Go up the stairs behind me and turn left at the top. Then just follow your nose till you get to Hazel's house. Go up the stairs behind you, then turn left and follow the path. Got it. Okay. Let's go. For him with the spots, it's running super slow. Oh, nice. You can do it one handed. I like that. Here it is, though. Very nice. Oh, what an intro. What an intro so far. Let's go, let's go. <clears throat> Meanwhile, that's here. L let me share my own stream. I ought to blast you. Not a bad idea, actually. My charm will bind, turn, and unwind. Look at it go. Uh, Grandma? Oh, it's you. Oh, my little honeybee. <laughs> I'm not so little anymore, Grandma. No, I suppose not. I'm so glad you've come. Me too. How can I help out around here? I don't know much about farming, but maybe you can show me the ropes. Uh, well, uh, oh, now that you mention it, uh, I haven't got the spring crop of potatoes in yet. Let me help, Grandma. Why don't you give me those seeds, and I can get them planted? That would be a good start. Here's the seeds. Let's go. Just head over to one of the garden beds there and, and scatter them about. All right. Let's start. 
You're natural. Now you'll need to water them if you want them to grow. You can fill it up at this old well. All right, all right. Let's water it. <coughs> there now. That should do it. It'll take a few days to grow, but it's a start. Oh, and I was thinking about cooking up some mushrooms. How would you like mushroom soup for dinner? Mm. Is it the same one you used to make when I was little? Because if it is, yes, please. <laughs> Lovely. You'll find plenty of mushrooms good for eating if you head up that mountain path a little. Wait, we have to pick the mushrooms ourselves? <laughs> no, this isn't the city, honeybee. Besides, freshly picked mushrooms... Things have changed, honeybee. Better. Yeah, if they're not the kind that poison you... You'll do just fine. <laughs> I'll do my best. Is there anything else I can do for you? Well, if you wanted to get some new seeds in town, it might be a good time to stop by and see the mayor. Introduce yourself. He's okay. at Town Hall, a big building in the center of town with a flag above the door. You can't miss it. I'll take good care of you and this farm, Grandma. I'm just so glad you're here, my sweet little honeybee. All right. Let's go. Here I am, farming. <laughs> This place has changed so much. It'll take a lot of work to get back to how I remember. Let's I don't see. know if city life has prepared me for this, but I'm ready to give it my best. Streaming a new game, you guys. You guys want to come by? Stop by. It's called Wildflowers. I love it. Fell in love with it, so I had to start again. So I want to stop this. Let's see. How do I pause this game? There you go. So I want to pause it because I I want to I want to see my my uh, what is it called? My uh, Facebook handle. I don't even know my Facebook handle. You guys, can you guys believe that? Let's see. Face Facebook. My pages. Jose Gaming, but I, I have no idea what my uh, handle is. Here we go. Oh. It's JP Curio Gaming. Facebook.com slash JP Curio Gaming. Thought I, it, it was a different one. I guess not. Let's go. All right. There you go. Let's get back to it, you guys. Hold on, I got a bunch of notifications here for some odd reason. All right, let's go. Let's go get those, uh, Those mushrooms. She says it should be up there. Which indeed they are right there. Hey, I remember this mine. It looked way less run down when I was seven. But so did everything around here. Let's go. Let's go take the mushrooms to grandma. Let's get our first test done. So I think the second task is gonna last a long time. Let's see. Ah, 
spring is the time when the earth reawakens. You can forage for the gifts the land offers up if you know where to look. Have you found any mushrooms? Well, yes, I did. Work? Those are nice, plump ones. You're a natural forager. When I was out searching, I came across that old mine. You used to tell me that there were goblins inside, remember? <laughs> I told you that, did I? <laughs> it was a, a smart way of keeping a curious little girl out of danger. Mm -hmm. Wooden support rotted clean through. Shame. I'm sure there's still perfectly good iron and copper down there. Come back tomorrow and I'll have the mushroom stew prepared. I'm a bit tired just now. Nice. Let's go. One-handed game. That's not bad. I like this. I need to go talk to the... To the mayor. <clears throat> heading down into town. Heading to the mayor. We gotta get to meet the people. Let's see. You'll see. You'll see. The mayor's all the way over here in his office. And if you guys can see the time. The time is very. It goes by really fast. Wait, the mayor's up there. Eee, I messed up. I done goofed. Especially since this is a time event. Not a time event, but everyone like goes home at 5 p.m. for some odd reason. Let's see. Oh, hello. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> I am Mayor Otto Soft, and you must be the new voter. I mean, neighbor. Uh, hi, uh... Yes, that's that's me. If there is anything you need, I'm the one to speak to. We're a friendly town here at Fairhaven. We want to make sure you're settled in well. Hey. To that end, we want you to meet everyone, so we've made it a little game. The fine Fairhaven folk will let me know after they've met you. That way, I can give you a prize after you've met everyone. It's really quite clever and progressive <laughs> plus a little bit creepy <laughs> you're funny anyway come and see me after you've met everyone i've met three people so far let's go meet some more there's a couple of people down here so let's go let's try to meet as much as we can today because like i said they do hey, go by fast i'm damon you're hazel's granddaughter yeah <laughs> How did you guess? You got the same eyes. They say, I'm beautiful, but I don't suffer fools. I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> I run the bar. Stop by for good vibes and a sympathetic ear any old time. Yeah, thanks. Awesome. Oh, hey, Bruno. Damon, I want to settle up for last night. Sorry I didn't have it on me at the time. <laughs> That's all right. I knew you were good for it, but, uh... <laughs> Thanks. Fish just haven't been biting lately. But I got Otto to float me for a week. I wish you hadn't told me that. Your son already has it out for me, Bruno. That's not so. He's just a teetotaler, is all. And who's your new friend here? Guten Tag. You're Hazel's granddaughter, aren't you? Yes. Are you German? And also psychic? <laughs> I'm Bruno. Don't actually speak much of my native tongue, but I try to keep up some traditions. And you're just a picture of your grandma when she was a girl. Hey. I am. Yeah. She was a real spitfire back then, too. Hasn't changed much. Ciao. I see you met Damon. Tara, watch out for this boy. He's trouble. Hey, I'm trying to make a good first impression here. Do you mind? Hey. Hey, that counted. Nice. All right, let's, let's go down to this guy. I think this is the butcher. Hi, I'm Kim. Hey, Kim. I'm Tara. I just moved here from the city. Oh. So what sent you screaming from the city? Dead end job? Sociopaths on dating apps? Well, I broke up with my fiance right before moving here. I tried the apps, but I think I keep swiping wrong. Uh. <laughs> We know what app Although she's using. Let's go. Bit on the slim side too. They're on the butcher. 
We only sell humanely treated animal products. Right now, I have to source the meat from off-island, but we'll hopefully get a new rancher to move here soon. Cool. Nice to meet you. Let's go. I really like this one-handed game. Let's go look at uh, this chick right here. Oh, two people. Nice. There you are. Oh, and Tara, too. Wonderful. Tara, this is my husband, Parker. Hi there. Hey, Parker. Ciao. Tara, I can't wait to buy your fresh crops. And if you need seeds, I can sell you whatever's in season. Oh, Parker, we need to talk about the kids. They were giggling over breakfast, so I searched Finn's backpack and found a whoopee cushion in there. Again. <laughs> I, I mean, that's, that's terrible. Uh, see? That's the problem right there. You think it's funny, and I have to be mommy cop. No, I'm taking this seriously, really. Okay, whatever. A whoopee cushion, you that's hilarious. Want to go to the next parent-teacher conference. I'm tired of getting stared down by Vanessa. All right. I'm trying to get as many people as I can today. Because you do have to sleep by a certain, a certain amount of time. A lot of these shops are closed on Monday. All right, let's talk to this person. Hello there. Nice to see a new face around here. Hi, I'm Hazel Wild's granddaughter, Tara. Oh, Hazel was so kind to me when I first moved here. We used to let me cut through a property to get to the old mine. Of course, that was before the supports and the entrance gave out. There's still good ore down there, I suspect. Or Oh, sorry. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Natalia, and I own the blacksmith. I can melt down ore into ingots and upgrade any of your farm tools for you. Let's go. Trying to finish this juice so I can fill it up with water. <clears throat> All right. Met a couple of people. Let's see if we can go meet up um, the cookie guy. Hey, is this guy open? This guy is open. Let's yes, see. I am that Angus. Excuse me? Oh, I could tell you were wondering if you recognized me. I am indeed the Angus who was on an episode of Baking Battles. And there's the Baking Battles <laughs> right here. nice to meet a fan. Oh, yes, I thought that was you. What with this being a, a bakery and all. <laughs> yeah. I guess it's obvious. My little claim to fame. I'm loving this game, you guys. I already talked to Otto. Oh, got to talk to the teacher. This is Vanessa, I believe. Welcome. I yeah. am Vanessa Soft, First Lady of Fairhaven. Pleasure to meet you. How is your grandmother doing? She's, well, to be honest, she's not doing too well. That's why I'm here. It's wonderful that you came to help her out. Do let me know if there is any way I can help. All right, I will. I will. Now let's go meet the kids. I'm getting a, a, oh, a hey, good chunk of them. Here. I'm Sebastian. Who are you? I'm Tara. I just moved here to help out my grandma Hazel. Do you know her? Oh, yeah. Hazel's cool. Like, for a grown up. <coughs> we'll see you around. <laughs> All right, let's talk to the other Mocosos here. You're a stranger. <laughs> yes, I I just moved here. I'm Tara. What's your name? Emmy. Well, now we're not strangers anymore, are we? Ciao. Let's go. Hello. Are you my mom's new friend? Depends. Who's your mom? Lena. Then yes. Nice to meet you. I'm Tara. Nice to meet you too. I'm Finn. I like the fact that they have this game to introduce the whole characters. I think it's just a way of you learning the whole area. Because it can get a little confusing afterwards. Hey, I was moving weird. Let's meet this guy. Welcome to the island. I am Messenger Cameron <coughs> Connor. Hey. As one newcomer to another, please let me know if there's anything I could do to help. Let's go. All right. I've been playing this game for about two weeks. Um, I actually uh, finished the storyline over on. On what is it called? 
on the Apple TV Arcade. So I know a thing or two about this game. How to meet this girl. My mom said I should make an effort to make you feel welcome in town or whatever. So, um, hi, I guess. <laughs> I'm Juliet. I'm Juliet. Hey, Juliet. It's nice to meet you. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. I got the baker already. Uh, I need a couple. A couple more people. Let's go to the beach, you guys. I already met everyone in there. Hey, this chick right here. Oh my they made gosh, her thick. Hazel's been hyping you up for weeks now. Well, now like when she I'm walks away, she be thick. I wish I had a grandma here to talk about how great I am. Pleased to meet you, Violet. We don't get too many new faces around here in Fairhaven, so let me know if you ever want to hang out. Okay, I got her. Give me a second, you guys. Let me let me do something here, okay? I gotta start sharing my own things, you guys, because I was scared. Ain't no one gonna be doing it for me, you know? Let's see. Mm -mm -mm, mm -mm -mm. Let me copy that link. Let me paste this here. Let's go. All right. I know the camera's in a weird angle, you guys. Uh, I will get to that later. Once I get my, my green screen up and running. This place has everything. Let's see if this guy is up and, up and about. Hey! Hey, I'm Tara. He's a jeweler. Ooh, new girl, I'm Francis. Ashante. Oh, you speak French? Well, no. I speak Spanish, though. Bienvenidos to our little seaside pueblo. Gracias. Hmm? Hey, the other guy left. Where he at? No, he's gone. Someone else was in there. He gone, gone. Oh, here he is. Hey, bro. Hey, but, uh, I I'm not a bro. My name's Kai. I run a kiosk near Town Square. Oh, there's the other one. Uh, Pop-up shop. What do you sell? Oh, dude, you have to see it to believe it. I only sell the most killer stuff I find off island. Come by and check it out. But like I say, if you fall in love with something, better get it. The yeah. merchandise is just whatever feels right in the moment. You know? Okay. Okay. Then we got to go get that, that other chick. This chick right here. I don't think I've seen you before. I run Cafe Moretti, the diner in town. Stop by any time. Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm I'm new here. Wait, you're Hazel's granddaughter. Welcome. I hope you come by soon. Moving always works up an appetite. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Sophia. Hey, Sophia. I'm Tara. It's nice to meet you. Let's go. We got so many people already. Let's see, I got... Hey, that's not it. I have... 19 out of 22. Nice. What do I have? Oh, 50 coins. Alright, let's see. Who, who am I going to meet over here now? Hopefully my future husband. Oh, let's get this thing right here.
please, let's get this here right here. Try to forage some stuff, man. These are a lifesaver. You're starting the witch weed. Oh, for the fast boost. I'm going to hoard them until I get that spell because you guys will not believe what a saver that is. That is a complete lifesaver right there. <clears throat> Let's go to bed. We did a lot today, not gonna lie. I'm just gonna forage in front of my house. Whatever I find here. The thistle also to recuperate your strength throughout the day. There's a tea you can make or a, uh, a potion, I think. Just making sure there's no other, uh, what is it called? Anything else that I can forage around here. Gotta get what you can get right here, because, like I said, it's really, really, it's really great game. You just have to know that to forage every day. It's like a must. Alright, let's go. Let's see. Yo, she in bed already. She's dreaming about potatoes. Hey. <sighs> what a long day. <sighs> you don't know the half of it. You do not know the half of it. Yeesh. What's going on? Eesh. Scary. I gotta water the plants, forage, and then try to go meet the rest of the... Oh. She has my soup, I think. Lena brought us some extra milk while you were out, so I made us a delicious mushroom soup sure to warm our bellies. And you're you're sure it had the right number of uh gills or whatever? We're not going to start seeing things or frothing at the mouth. Oh no, if I gave you something that made you see things, it'd be on purpose. A uh, grandma! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, honeybee. That's hilarious. You know, I have another chore for you that would be a great help if you don't mind of course grandma what is it some wood for the fire would be nice nights are still cold in the spring around here could you go and find a couple of the big old logs lying around the farm chop them up for me and bring me the wood sure thing grandma uh, you'll need this to get started <laughs> All right, let's go. Let me go water my. Don't forget to water those potatoes every day. I know, I know. <laughs> More than big chunks. Here we go. She specifically said chunks for a reason. Give the wood to grandma. And give her the wood. Let's see. <clears throat> Town doesn't open up till about nine or ten, so, so I'm still oh, good. Oh, that wood looks nice and dry and <coughs> ready to burn. Great. 
Thank you for doing that for me. It was no trouble. Phew. It was hard work, though. Oh, look at you. You're plum tuckered out. What do they teach young girls in the city these days, anyway? If you work too hard and don't keep an eye on your energy, you're likely to pass out. And pass but out, an indeed. Solution. Good old-fashioned country cooking. Here's another serving of the soup I made earlier. It'll fix you right up. Let's go. All right, let's let's go finish off meeting the people. There's someone over here on the what is it called at the beach. Oh, it's a thistle, huh? There's uh, mushrooms here as well. There's nothing over there. The thistle it works really well, especially with the flower. I think one of the 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 first things that you need is to um, collect thistle to give to Violet, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Are there any? Is there anything to forage up here? Ah, mushroom. It's all good though. I'll take it. All right. Let's go take the long way to uh, to the beach. And let's let's get that witch weed. Hopefully, it's still there. It's early morning. Usually, you find it early morning right here. It's about a seventy-five percent chance you actually find it. So let's, let's 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 get. Is it Thomas? Hi, I'm Tara, Hazel Wild's granddaughter. Nice to meet you. No, I remember you. you. Used to run past my farm on the way to the beach when you were little. Yes, and Grandma always told me to mind that I didn't trample your crops. You're Thomas, right? Yep. Gosh, your farm has the most stunning view on the whole island. I'm not selling. I, I didn't mean... Your grandma needs help on her farm. But it's not as easy as just moving here and picking up a pitchfork. I know. I'm here to learn. For Hazel's sake, I hope you learn quick. Yeesh, what a D-bag. This guy, who do you think he is? Sheesh. What a deucers, man. I think I only need a few more people. I think two more people. I met I met this guy. Mm. Look at the kitty. Aww. I met this guy. I met this girl. Oh, I met this guy here too. I met this guy, I met her, uh, Amira. Amira is very chow. They're very chow together, both of these girls. And who is this beautiful creature I see? I, uh, what, uh, I'm Tara, Hazel's granddaughter. <laughs> Hazel told me her granddaughter was coming to town, but didn't mention that she was so lovely. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm Amira, the doctor here in Fairhaven. I've been taking care of your grandmother. Oh, wow, thank you. I came as soon as I heard she was sick. She's lucky to have such a caring family. Well, I mean, to be honest, we kind of fell out of touch for a while. I'm trying to make up for lost time. We can't regain lost time, but you're here for her now. That is enough. Hey, I need one more person. He's out in the woods. I met Parker. Fairhaven Woods, let's go. Oh, I can forage here too. <clears throat> That's the house that we need to go to right there. That's a cool looking tree. With mushrooms. Let's 
So if I were to give you guys any advice as to how to do things, don't ever uh, sell things. Keep them to yourself because you are going to need a lot of these things in the future. That's like the biggest advice I can give you guys for this game. Everything's yours, man. Hey, where's this guy at? Let's see. Shelby is the last guy that I need to talk to. He's either usually here, rarely goes into town, but if he does, you can find him like at the beach or something. There's whispering? Something spooky and weird is... Mm -hmm. You're telling me, Tara. All right, let's see. Homeboy wasn't anywhere around here. Shall be the last one that I need, so. Oh, nope. What? It, don't wear yourself out. Eat something from your bed. Oh, that's right. I need to eat something. All right. Let's eat this soup. Nice. Hey, return to grandma. I need one more guy. Use your map to visit areas. That's the last guy that I need. I'm gonna buy some bait from this guy and see what's up. Can I buy bait? Oh, I if can't. If you can't find me at my stall, I'll be by the lake in the woods. Well, and Damon's pub. But all I catch there is grief from Otto for staying out too late. Yeah, you can't buy things just yet. Eee. All right, let's forage at the beach. If we don't find Shelby around here, we're gonna go back to Grandma. Let her know what's up. Be like, hey, I ate something already we're talking about. Ish. Let's forage these coconuts. These coconuts. All right. Seaweed is also very, very good uh, for later on. Shelby, found the guy. what I tell you guys? Hi, I'm Tara. I just moved to town. You look just like I pictured. I'm sorry, what? Oh, uh, being Hazel's granddaughter, I mean. Oh, and you are? Been many things, but if it's a name you're looking for, folks here call Achieved unlock. Shelby. Let's go. It was so smart, I couldn't even see the achievement down there. All right, let's just go over here. The reason why I knew where to find people and stuff, because I've been playing the game. Like I said, I played it for two weeks, fell in love with it. Um, past the storyline, but there's way more to do. So, it's not like I'm done with the game. Mm -mm. So, you guys will see. It's really fun game, you guys, like I said. It's like Stardew Valley, but it's not. Alright, let's return to Grandma. Walking off slowly. Tango's by super quick in this game, not gonna lie. Alright, let's see. See, a bit of food is all you need when your energy is low and then your <coughs> rise rain. For a while, you still need plenty of sleep. Even my cooking is no match for a good night's rest. But, Grandma, you're the one who should be resting. I don't want you troubling yourself to cook for me. Ah, is that your way of trying to get my recipe book? Did Sophia put you up to it? Bruh. She's always trying to get a peek at my recipes, but you can tell her they stay in the family. I hide my recipe book in the stove. She never thinks to look in there. <laughs> Go on. Try one. Okay. 
Well, which one is your favorite? I am quite partial to mushroom risotto. Okay, tomorrow we shall buy rice. I better not just yet. I bet. Let's see. It doesn't let me. Let's go cut some wood, you guys. Let's cut this little tree. <clears throat> you guys. Ah, no. You guys will not believe how much, like, energy you use cutting up these, uh, these, these trees, especially the bigger ones. When you're just beginning, go for the smaller ones only. That's why I said in the beginning, there's a reason why she says, do the little ones, you know? So I'm going to use up all my energy, use up all my time right here. Hey, you can't cut these just yet. Later on, you can cut those. Man, I can play this game for hours, you guys. Let's go. I could. Nah, let's just go to bed. Rise and shine from butt to spot. Yeah. So tomorrow we will do. Well, not tomorrow, like me, but I mean, like tomorrow in the game, we'll um. <coughs> we'll go to. <clears throat> ah, we'll go to the to the mayor. We'll forage, and then we'll uh we'll go. I think um that one girl, uh Lena is it Lena the one that has the the stuff? <laughs> oh, are your allergies acting up? Oh no, it's all the dust in the front room. <laughs> But sweeping makes my back ache, so I've turned a blind eye for no months now. But that's exactly what I'm here to help with, Grandma. Then would you mind showing those dust bunnies the front door? There's a broom in my room you can use. You wait out here. Those dust bunnies have no idea what's coming for them. So. I'll have to move this rug to make real headway. Whoa! Is that an actual trap door? Jeez, Grandma. What are you keeping down there? Ciao. Grandma be keeping uh, so people down there. The <laughs> trap door under the rug. Hmm? What is it for? Preserves and pickles? Or old machinery? It's not important, honeybee. Will you be out and about tonight? Probably, but I... Could you fetch me some moonflower? It only blooms after sunset. You'll know it by the white blossoms. See, my moonflower tea blend makes me feel so healthy. I get a blush on these old cheeks. Go right past Parker's workshop into the woods and you'll find what you need. I feel like I'm getting redirected here. I, at my age, it's awfully hard to hear certain things. Did you... Put the rug back in place. Yes, uh, Grandma, but... Uh, but are you brewing moonshine down there? You can tell me if you're brewing moonshine. Mm, I can already taste that tea. Yeesh. That was normal. That's funny. Confirm. All right. What was I... Oh, yeah, let's go water the... Uh, the, the, the buds. The spuds. How many more days does this have? Let's see. Three days. All right, we gotta go buy rice. Go see Otto. What do you know? She's here. All right, let's see. Let's buy rice. I'm gonna buy two just to be safe. 
Thank you. And let's go see Otto. Oh, he's up there, I believe. Oh, my nose. It'd be itchy. All right, let's see. Wonderful. The last citizen has let me know that you've been introduced. As promised, here is your reward for playing our little game. We hope it helped you acclimatize. Uh, thanks. Uh, money's great, too, though. <laughs> hey, yo, let's go. Let's see. Uh, Mike the Rice, that one steeped in the mystery. So that's going to have to wait till tonight. So let's go forage and we'll go make the, the rice. Let's go forage to the... Oh, I didn't even go to, uh, to what's that fool's name's house? I forget that fool's name. Uh, Thomas's house. He has the witch weed growing, uh, across from his house. And I didn't even forage on my, on my area for the thistle. Well, let's go up here first. Like I said, you want to go early in the morning. Sometimes later in the day, it's gone. Now you see, it's not there right now. Or is it here? Yeah, it's usually here. Yeah, you want to go early in the morning. Let's forage around here. Let's see what we find. We got plenty of time. Okay, seaweed is good. Seaweed is good. We got some bananas. Good job. We got a concha, a seashell. Let's go to the other side. Also, another thing, don't sell your pearls. I did that on my on my end, and you're going to need them later on in life. Trust me. Don't do it. Don't do it at all. I know you can barely see my face. It's um, it's by design. I'm ugly, so I don't want you guys to see me, you know? There it is. All right. Hey, yo. Did I go around here? I did not. But I think uh, I don't have anything so far today. Let's see. <coughs> the weeds are also really good for you guys. Uh, you guys... Uh, you can get, uh, you can expand your farm with the weeds. Uh, you can also get like uh, stuff later on. You can create stuff with, with the weeds itself. Uh, very helpful in the game. All right, let's, let's get cooking. Let's get cooking. I better not. Oh. I think I have everything we need. Now, I've written down the recipe here. Head on over to the stove. Give it a try. Let's go. All right. Let's head over to the stove. Uh, I don't want sushi. Uh, mushroom risotto. Here it goes. what she wanted. Let's do one only. Let's go give it to her. That's what, that's, that's what she wants. Here you go, Grandma. Here's your mushroom risotto. Oh, thank you, honeybee. It smells wonderful. But you made enough for yourself, I hope. <laughs> I did not. I don't need no stinking soup. Hey, all right. Let's go up there since we have time to kill you guys. Is it this over there? Yeah, let's go. Uh, we're going to need the thistle uh, for our first. Oh, I forget. This one's broken. Um, We're going to need a thistle later on. So. Right now, I'm not growing anything unnecessary. I'm not buying anything unnecessary. I'm just doing whatever they're asking me to do. I feel like in the beginning, that, that, sh that should be the go-to, you know? I don't want to get ahead of my game. I don't want to get too crazy into it. So, I'm just going to come by here. 
Uh, I will buy, like, uh, I think some. I'm not going to do flowers just yet. But I'm going to... Uh... Can I buy stuff from this guy already? Let's go. Let's see. Your grandma was always good luck on a boat back in the day. She had a heron's eye for spotting fish. But how can you see fish if they're underwater? <laughs> she hasn't taught you much, has she? Uh, um, potatoes? Here, take this rod. Keep your eyes peeled whenever you're near water for the shadows of swimming fish. When you see them near the surface like that, you know they're feeding. Trick is to get one of them to nibble on your hook instead of the bait fish they're chasing. How do I do that? You'll need some bait. Here are some worms. Hey, you're not the squeamish type, are you? You gotta hook your bait and cast your line. You'll feel when you got one and then reel it in. Uh, wait, 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 back up. How do I cast my line? <laughs> You'll get the hang of it. The lake in the woods is a nice place to start. Uh, but take care, you hear? Don't go in those woods after sunset. I've seen things, well, you wouldn't believe me. My boy Otto didn't need it till he saw it for himself. Just stay safe and come back and see me after you've given it a few tries. Let's go. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Meanwhile, we're going to go uh, fishing. Let's go fishing, you guys. You want to uh, talk with them once in a while? They will have like a little exclamation mark once you guys have seen them. Just the way they, you saw it there. So you can come in and just be like, okay, no, no, no exclamation mark. Let's go. And they will have it. Let's forage. Since we're here. Like I said, it's very important to forage for stuff. I know you guys right now is like, ah, why? And all this. Trust me. You want to. Especially mushrooms. You you need some mushrooms. Let's, let's do this real quick. I want the big guys. These are all the same. I think they're going to give me the same ones over and over. Just to begin with. I got a char. Oh, there's a big guy right here. I want the big guy. Don't be afraid to uh, li leave them hooked. Like that. I don't want that guy. I want the big guy over there. There, and then just reel it in. Click it, and then just reel it in. Let's go. Gross. Let's go. I'm nose. And there's another fishing spot over here. Let's check it out. Hey, there's a cricket right there. I'm gonna get the fish, not the recipe. That's a recipe. You want to unlock those like a lot. I should start unlocking now. Tell Bruno you've been fishing. I will. I will. Man, there's been a shortage of, of extra, extra hot Cheetos. That's what I'm eating right now. I found them at the store. Uh, I texted my brother. I'm like, hey, yo, they got some. He's like, give me a bag. It's the family size. So, yeah, he's like, give me a bag, bro. I'll pay you back. I'm like, let's go, homie. Let's go. Hey, you guys can see me on my phone, huh? I'm just making sure that the comments, there's no one here in the comments and stuff, because I did see some people here. But um, they probably just came in and checked it out and left. Hey, let's go. This is Mandrake. Yeah. Also very important. Here's that. This is it. As the moon flower. Uh, hello? <laughs> Shouldn't spy on strange people creepily creeping through the woods at night. Come along, Elder Hazel. Don't rush me, I'm coming. Grandma? Where did she go? 
She shouldn't be out here at night. Elder Hazel, this is the third time you've come to the circle without your robe and mask. This is an unacceptable risk. Bah, it's time for us to come out of hiding. The town won't be afraid of witches if they know that we're their neighbors. People seem nice until the day comes when they need a scapegoat for their troubles. Then people become mobs. Uh -huh. I didn't bring Terra here so she could skulk around like she's doing something wrong just by being who she is. So you think your intuition was right then? She has the gift? When will she be ready to join us? Join them? Give you something. Uh oh. She's like, Vamanos. She's like, I'm out of here. Her grandma did that on purpose. She wanted to, for her to see her. Oh, that one's a hard one. I'll grow cauliflower. Why not? I need to grow something. going here you know I don't think I've been in here since your grandpa died sorry I was just looking around like you said I didn't mean to pry no no it's fine I just wasn't as good with my hands as he was he gave most of his tools to Thomas since I knew he'd put them to good use if we want to get this place up and running though we'll need to put in the work here too he always made a whole lot more money from his crafts than just the farm produce alone if you ever want to try your hand at it, I kept the blueprints to all his tools right here. Thanks, Grandma. Not sure if I'm a handy Tara, but I'll try for us. Let's go. Ooh, let's see. Paper press, candle makers. Uh, we'll, we'll get to all that right now. We'll get to all that. <laughs> let's go. <clears throat> oh actually you know what let's get some wood you guys because we are gonna sell some wood so we need some wood let's chop out this little tree i like to do this at the end of the day because whatever i don't do i just go to sleep and my health will regenerate Look at these trees are, they will take, for, oh, I can't do these trees yet. I forget. Yeah, you can only do the little small ones and these little ones that are falling. I'm going to have to get going now. I think uh, you can only stay up till midnight or one. Then you get sick. I don't want that because you have to pay Amita a certain amount. It will tell you it's time to go to bed. And then it it warns you. Alright, time for bed. <clears throat> did I water the, the plant? I did. We're going to confront Grandma in the morning. See what she was doing out oh, so late. So tired. Grandma, I've been, um, I've been thinking about my childhood memories of your garden. Just bursting with veggies in every color. 
I think we could bring it back to the way it was. Are you sure? That's quite a bit of work. What would we need? <laughs> well, for it to be enough to feed us and turn a profit, you'd need to build a bunch more garden beds. That means keeping a compost bin so you can get a whole lot of good soil to fill them. And you'll need to chop some wood to make the beds. Okay. I'm on it. There it is. Grandma, so uh, can we talk about the fact that I saw you with some people in masks and robes in the woods last night? It would be nice to talk after I've had some tea. Grandma. Oh, yes, yeah, some tea would really Eesh. hit the spot. Let's make her tea. I think I have all the ingredients. It's a drink. Here, restorative tea. You see, moonflower and the thistle. That's what you need. Let's go. Let's give it to Grandma. Mm. Oh, my. Oh, you make a very potent brew. Here's that key to the basement that you asked about. But the hooded strangers? Go on down, my dear. It will all make sense, I promise. Yeesh. Let's go downstairs. Okay, I definitely have more questions than answers now. Uh. Hey. Not just any cauldron, your cauldron. What? Oh no, I'm not a. Which? Oh, my dear, yes, you are. No lay person could make a brew like that on her first try. I feel as spry as I did 50 uh, years ago. <clears throat> this basement is your sanctum. You have your cauldron, of course. W -w wait, I is Dad a witch or, 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 or warlock or... Arthur? Oh, no. Uh, no, honeybee, he's more conventional. I'm afraid, but I saw that spark of magic in your eyes the first mm. time I held you. I've always known you would be an extraordinary witch, but the coven needs proof before they'll accept you. Coven? Well, those folks in the woods, of course. They put a charm on the bramble wall, so you'll need a wand to open it. This is, uh, kind of a lot to learn all at once. I understand, honeybee. When you're ready, read this incantation before the special silver willow in the woods. Then you'll have a branch to make your first wand. All right, let's go. Let's water these potatoes. That's a lot to do today. Let's do this here. All right. I won't be foraging today here. I need to go see if I still have, if there's a witch weed over here. I know you guys are saying you are probably like obsessing over that. I am not. Trust me. That and the thizzle. Very, very good things to have in hand. At the end, I'll show you guys once I, I've, I've used up my energy. Um, that tea that she drank, really good to like uh, restore your energy. At this point, it restores mostly all your energy. Later, there's better things to, to do with it, but as of right now. All right, we got to buy some cauliflower seeds. Does this guy have something for me? Nope. Oh, she closed today, huh? 
Autos close this. Well, oh no, here he is. Sometimes you can give it to them out, out here. Sometimes you can't. Wonderful. You got the look of a lifelong angler in your eyes now. <laughs> oh, now here's a real challenge. Catching a certain fish is about the right bait, the right place, and luck. I got a hankering for some nice, fresh striped sea bass. They're ocean fish, so you gotta go to the beach. They might go for a worm, but you'll have better luck with this. In the future, you can keep bait fish you catch to try and hook bigger and more valuable fish. Come back when you caught one. <coughs> one sea bass, huh? Where was I going? I forget where I was going. Oh, she has a challenge for me. Let's see what's up. Oh, just who I was hoping to see. Who? Me? Here, take this to Hazel. Oh, I couldn't. Nonsense. Take it. Your grandma and I have a friendly pie rivalry of sorts. This is my answer to her last move. Hey, devastatingly perfect key lime tart. I bake with love, but I also bake to win. Uh, okay. I'll make sure she gets it. Let me know how she likes it. Let's go. We're going to the woods. We're going to go get our wand. We're going to go get our wand on. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes. Oh, I also need to build a, a, a compost bin. Totally forgot. Oh, a peanut. Let's go. There's another cricket. There's some wild mushrooms here. Totally need that. All right, let's let's, let's come here. Cause no one's watching. They're only the people that are walking around. Uh, let's see. The inscription says, "If I be worthy, ancient tree, give a silver branch to me." Please. Hey. Oh, uh, I mean, uh, uh, thanks, magic tree. Let's go. We'll show Grandma the branch, all right. All right. Like I said, a lot to do today. I needed a cauliflower, but that chick there is off today. Which is weird because she's off Saturday, Sunday, too. No bueno. All right, let's go try to catch some fish, you guys. Why not, right? Because there's really not much I need to do. Hey, I can give Parker that stuff. Give me a second, you guys. Let me go back. It's so hard to come to money at this point, but later on it gets better. This is a real help. Let's go. Vamanos. I already forgot what I was doing. Oh, that's right. <clears throat> I'm catching fish. Wait, what did he give me? Did he give me uh, crickets? Chub, catfish. I'm gonna go buy crickets, you guys. I mean, worms and crickets. Might seem like a lot, but I can sell him the fish too, so. The fish that I catch, I can sell it to him. Get a profit, you know? <clears throat> I think I need a big fish. 
A striped sea bass, I think he said. So we'll forage the area, and as you guys can see, I'm looking for somewhere to fish. Usually there's areas around here. Oh. Yeah, he did give me chub fish. Let's get the big one. We're going for the big one. Sea bass. Wait, is lure one sea bass? There you go. We, we got her done, but he's already off, so might have to wait till tomorrow. Let's do some more fishing, though, you guys. Sell the rest to him. Oh, I want to get that one right there. Let's go. Squid doesn't sell for so much. There's another big one. Let's see. That part, Kate, wasn't in too detail like that. Like, I had to figure out how to fish. It didn't tell me that you could wait for the next one. Which is unfortunate because it took me forever to, like, catch that one fish. <coughs> I want the big boys, okay? And I will wait for the big boys. Ooh, quick. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> All right, we've, we've been getting lucky. I'm gonna fish till about nine. Because the house is straight up there. You've caught a halibut. Is it a halibut or halibu? It's all right. Let's go. That wasn't there in the morning. That's another thing. Things can change from morning to to evening. So always go go around and double check stuff. Uh, the reason why I wanted to finish at night is because I want to go up here and check to see if it, there's no thistle up here. Or wild mushrooms. No, we're good. Let's go down here. Let's chop some wood, you guys. And yes, um, fishing does take up energy as well, but not as much as chopping all this. Later on, you can get rid of all those stuffs too. Let's just go uh, and see if I can build another compost. Let's see if I can build a compost. This is why I told you guys compost bin build. It costs 10 coins. So let's do that. Um, how do I want to do this? Okay. 
Okay. Zoom, 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 zoom. Okay, that's how I'm gonna do it. Should I wake her up? I'm gonna wake her up. Let's do Great some of these job. things. Now we just need to fill it with weeds and let it work it. Then we can start making garden beds. And there you go. Is your wand ready? Yes. Look. Hey, where did she pull it out from? Where you point that thing? Oh my, you have a lot to learn. It's time for you to meet the coven. Are you ready to go? Yes. Sure. Let's go. Okay. The brambles only allow friends of the coven through. So this incantation helps it to identify you. Once it meets you, it'll know you're a friend and let you through from now on. Say the spell when you're ready. Friend of the Coven comes to you. Unravel your brambles and let me through. Oh, it worked! Well done. Now, let's head on up. The way she walks. Grandma, what is this place? Who are these people? Shh. You've got to be properly introduced. Who approaches the sacred circle? I bring one who wishes to know the mysteries of this coven. Um, hi. Welcome, Initiate. Elder Hazel has told us so much about you. I am the High Priestess of this coven. Before you can join us, you must vow to never reveal the location of our circle or the details of our rights to any others. Do you promise to abide by our covenants? Sure. Um, I promise. I'm so excited that I'm a witch. This is going to be so much fun. Uh, uh, about that, honeybee. You're not a witch. Not yet. First, you must cast the initiation rite. Oh, okay. Um, but how do I, how do I do that? Speak to the Farseer over yonder. He will explain the art of incantations. Boost harvest potion can now be crafted. Let's go. Are you the Farseer? What? Yes, yes, Farseer, that's me. No, I'm nearsighted. Farseer. <laughs> you know, you sound a little bit like... You've no idea who I am. I'm wearing a mask. Listen, do you want to sit here playing guessing games? Or do you want to learn more magic? Magic. Great. I'm going to teach you the art of incantations. Mm. Tricky stuff. stuff. Mess it up. And there won't be much left of you beyond dust. That sounds a bit dangerous to start with. Only to fool initiates that don't follow instructions. Now, listen closely. Are you ready? I'm ready. Great. I need you to chop lots of wood. What? Turn it into paper. Right. You'll need a paper press. Put it in your tool shed. How will this help me with incantations? All will be revealed. <laughs> One of us is clearly crazy. I'm beginning to think it's me for listening to you. Let's go. Gotta go home. I wish she would run faster. Hey, don't stop. Don't mind if I do. Uh, don't mind if I do. Let's go. Oof. I gotta make it on time, you guys. I have like... 
40 minutes. Grandma's walking slower than I am, so... Maybe. Oof. At one, I pass out, you guys. Come on, come on. Oh, I'm gonna pass out. Oh, no. I'm almost there. No. My heart is thumping. Time for I'm here. Bed. Ooh. <sighs> Just made it. Oh, good. You're up. The mayor's called a town meeting this morning. We should get down there and see what he's making a fuss about this time. Do you think it's some kind of trouble? Ah, uh, I really hope not, but I guess we'll see. Lead the way, Grandma. Follow me. Let me water my stuff first. I'd better follow Grandma to the... Yes, we are going to be there. Hey, it's not letting me. Follow her. I'm going to be there first, talking about. It's a racing game. Has anyone posted stuff here more? Oh, I guess I can't. Settle down, everyone. Settle down. I've brought you together to discuss a very important matter. There have been very strange goings on in our beloved town of Fairhaven. There is a force at work in our community, and I don't know who's responsible, but whoever they are, they don't have Fairhaven's best interests at heart. Oh, I don't like where this is going. Me neither. I've seen strange lights in the forest at night. Yeah. And folks in robes and masks wandering around after sunset. Yes! Yes, good. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Wait, I'm sure there's a rational explanation for all this. Uh -huh. No matter the cause, we must ensure our town doesn't become a home for rouseabouts and unsavory types. I ask all of you to keep a sharp eye out for signs of mischief. And if you see anything, report it to me. Or me, if you prefer. I'd hate for anyone in Fairhaven to feel fearful. Well, I never. Mayor yes. Otto, soft on business. <laughs> soft in the head is more like it. Him and his fancy britches wife standing up hey. there and casting judgment on others. Uh-oh. You're even better than I thought. He can't just tell people to spy on their neighbors, to be so afraid that they distrust everyone around them. Maybe we could cast a goodwill spell to make everyone be nice to each other? I wish it were that simple. But just because you can solve a problem with magic doesn't mean you should. Hey, good Thomas knowledge, Grandma. Could use some help on his farm. I know he's got an order of beans due, and he doesn't have enough plots going to make it in time. He's too proud to ask for help, though. <laughs> Here, take these seeds. They should be enough to make the order. Are these magic beans? <laughs> oh, heavens no. <laughs> but if you've got the means to give him a boost, it certainly wouldn't hurt. Hmm, okay. I know exactly what she's talking about. What is this? Oh, nice. Oh, I'll, I'll get that to that other guy right now. Let me go water my my plants. Actually, first let me go here. See if I can make a paper press. Thirty coins. I think I got. I got it. Make a paper press. Two pieces of paper. Let's go.
Got it. I'll go tonight. What am I doing? All right, let's see this here. This here, let's see, give me a second. So this is it. I think I need eight, right? She said. Uh, no, uh, where's my beans? Eight, okay. So there was a something that it said that I had unlocked uh, a growing potion or something like that. So let's check it out. Let's see what we need, you guys. It's this potion right here. Uh, Mandrake and conch shells. Let's craft. There's eight hours remaining. Cool. So, so that's cool. I think it doubles it. So that should be cool. Let's see how much is this? Four days remaining. Yeah. Uh, what else was I gonna do today? Water. Oh. You must be plotting something. Build garden beds. That's right. I said 24 hours. Started late, but... 10 hours left. No. Alright. So I need some wood. Let's go chop up some wood. Now you guys know why I said that those things were very, very important. You need them to make more, more beds, garden beds. Okay, yeah, there's, there's more over here. Let's get these. All right, let's, let's, let's go see Otto. I'll take the shortcut down here. I feel like it's a shortcut. It feels longer, but I feel like you get to your place faster. Let's go All right here. Like I said, don't, don't, don't sell anything unless you really know, like the fish I can sell. Why not? But when it comes to like flowers, plants and all that stuff, you're going to need it. Acorns, even the acorns you're going to need later on in the game. Just hoard them all, man. Let me go go get my price over here. Oh, is he close to there? Let's see what what is this guy selling right now. <coughs> Saffron, chili peppers. No, I don't think. I'm not gonna need any of that stuff yet. Chocolate, you need. Um, Okay, this one soon, this one tonight, tomorrow, and this one's going to take a couple days. But that incantation is pretty cool. Let's see. Does anyone else have an exclamation? I'm just killing time. I'm going to forage over here. I should have foraged at the beach. Totally. Totally missed it there. Man, Drake, this is really, like I said, to grow crops faster, like double, almost double it. You need that a lot. You also need it later on for like spells and everything, but. Like I said, don't sell anything. Don't use things out of the ordinary. Just 
try to keep everything everything for yourself because things go off season you're gonna need stuff and it's like what in the free holidays you know I've caught a char. Trust me, those chars are gonna... There's some tasks that you need to do with for those. The tasks usually just get you money. But like I said, it, it, it's worth it. Eesh. I wanna get the big one since I... Uh, I use the, the big bait. Nope. Let's go. Let us go. my hazels up there and see what's up a lot of tasks in the beginning later on you get bigger tasks but they take more time let's, let's, let's look at the far seer i got it great just what we need hang on to those and you'll have a use for them in two shakes incantations of spells read aloud they require vast amounts of magic and special ingredients at the time of writing them down and are consumed when read aloud but they make incredible change to the world a lot of the most powerful spells are incantations whoa what do I need to do? I like your spirit. The next step is obvious. Time for you to go fishing. Wait, what? Ah, just any old fishing. You'll only catch what you need at the beach, which is south of Thomas's farm. You must catch me. So I got one. I've had a hankering for calamari for days now. I thought you were teaching me to do these powerful spells. I am the best way I know how. Pay attention. Go get me those squid. Go speak with Elder Hazel. She'll teach you all about the magic you'll need to write your incantation. Come back to me when you're done. Let's go. You did a great job casting your incantation to get your wand branch. But actually writing incantations can be a touch trickier. Yes, I gathered that I have a lot to gather. It's not just that. When you write your incantation, you'll need to draw magic from the wellspring to charge it with power. Draw what from where? Didn't you notice the great big cauldron right by the circle? Yeah, but I just figured it was for extra big batches of potions. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no. The coven cauldron is where we leave offerings for the wellspring. Oh. The source of all magic here on the island. Our task as a coven is to maintain the wellspring. We cannot draw more energy from it then we put in. I wrote the incantation you read before the Elder Tree, drawing from my magic reserves. But to craft your initiation incantation, you'll need your own. Go on and offer something to the Wellspring. Over time, you will learn that it likes some offerings more than others. Try different things and see what happens. So now I can cast spells? Cool. Careful. We must never draw more magic from the wellspring than we need. Our offer.
offerings keep it in balance. What happens if it falls out of balance? Nothing for you to worry about, my dear. It is all of our responsibility to maintain the cauldron, and we've never failed in my lifetime. Just remember to leave offerings regularly. Okay, I will. Good girl. Now, you'd better get to work on writing your first incantation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Look at those beautiful squid. Good work, novice. So, when you finish your lunch, can we get back to incantations? No, no, these aren't for lunch. You need to make some nice black ink, and squid ink is the best. Uh, you could have said so. I just did. Now, you'll need a desk. Set it up in your sanctum. Ah, that's your basement. You wouldn't want anyone to happen on your half-written incantations. Once you've got your ink, there's a couple more things you'll need. Come back here, and I'll give them to you. Yeesh. Come on, Perseer. Just come to me now. Come on. Hey. hey, I can play with on keyboard. I didn't even know that. Let's see. Let's see how this goes, you guys. It might be better with, with just the keyboard. Sometimes when I when, when you want to collect your harvest and everything, I think it's better to do it with with the with the with the mouse because <clears throat> you can check to see sometimes you, you don't want to uh, unplant something. I've done that before and it is it is horrible. You're like, ah, oh, I don't want to do that. OK, so we'll do this collect. We're looking for the new blueprint. Uh, what do we need? A desk. That's what he said. 50? Ah, okay, we gotta go sell some stuff tomorrow. So, unfortunately, I can't do that today. Alright. Is it time for bed? I'm gonna take a quick break. I'm gonna use the potty and get some water, and then I'll be right back, you guys.
All right, I'm back, you guys. Sorry about that. Uh. All right, let's go. Uh, yes, it is time for bed. Let's see. No, I don't have anything here. Oh, I forgot to produce that one thing. Okay, these are ready. Let me water these. I forgot to uh, do the, the potion thing here. So right now, look. So this is pretty cool. It makes four. But you use this here. And now it will make six. I still need more, though. So I'm going to have to uh, plant the other ones here. I'm going to go here. Collect. So we can make one garden bed now. Right? Oof, no, because we need the monies. That's right. <clears throat> Let's go, uh, I think, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. I think she's gonna tell us to sell the, the potatoes. I can't thank you enough for helping out here, sweetheart. Are the potatoes ready to harvest? Yes, yes. Grandma. Here's Already harvested them, we're field. talking about. Oh, wonderful. Maybe you've got a greener thumb than you thought. Why don't you take them down to the general store and sell them? You know I'm it. sure Lena will give us a fair price for them. I just forage on our way over there. I know, I know. You guys are probably like, forage again? Come on. But trust me. It is pretty awesome. <laughs> you guys will, will, will get in the habit of foraging for stuff. Come on. Ish, not there today. All right, let's go to. I'm wasting some time because I want to sell the fish to uh, that one guy. Whatever his name is. Let's go. Afterwards, you can feed that fit, that that thing. Spoil alert. Uh -huh, nothing there. Nothing there. Let's sell these potatoes. Let's go shopping. Let me sell these two because I, I, I need them. I need the monies. Uh, let's sell the coconuts too. Uh, uh, uh. <coughs> let's sell the fish to this guy too. Let's see. Oh, would you look at that beauty? What would you like for your prize? I would like a shower. <laughs> Nah, smelling like cut bait is part of the life. You'll get used to it. Speaking mm -hmm. of bait, here's some more. I've given you three different kinds of bait. Give them all a try. They'll catch different fish in different water. Happy angling. Let's go. Let's see. Can I sell my fish to him already? There's a chub. Let's sell that. 
Uh, the squid I can sell. Let's sell that. Let's sell this. Plenty of money to do whatever I need to do. Let's see what else. What else was I going to do? Incantation. I need to do that. That. Ah! Soybeans. Oh, that's right. I need, uh... I need those seeds to, uh... Cauliflower seeds that are out season? No, I want to buy... Oh, it says sell more. I don't have anything to sell. To unlock that. Okay. Let's see, what is this guy selling? Cinnamon. I'm going to buy that. Trust me. We'll need that later on. Not now, but we'll need it. <clears throat> Alright. It's just nice to have around. All right, let's build this first. Desk. No. Uh, uh, no. What was I? What was I gonna buy? Wait. It was the desk. Was no? Because the desk is right here. No, it was a desk. It was a desk. Let's put that over here. Tell the first year you built the desk. Okay, yeah. So now, oh, the potatoes. That's right. Let's see. Lena bought the potatoes just as you said. Oh, here's the money, Grandma. Ah, I won't hear of it. You did all the work. You deserve the reward. But Grandma, I. I mean it. If you want to keep fixing things up around here, you'll need all the cash you can get anyway. Buy some more seeds. If we keep the fields planted, we'll always have a way to make ends meet. Well, okay. But only because I'm going to use the earnings to help the farm. Let's go. All right, let, let's build that extra bed, you guys. We're going to need it later on. So why not build it now? 25? Oh, I need wood now. It's always one thing or another. All right, let's go get the wood. If we can find some, sometimes there's there's none for you to chop. Because they're, they're not small. You see? Maybe over here? Yeah, there's some over here. Those rocks, you might think, oh, they're just rocks, but they're they're used quite a bit. All right, so I'm, I'm gonna create the bed and then go fishing. That's that that's how I made my money most of the time in the beginning. And that's the way I'm going to do it. All right, let's see. Let's create another garden bed. Let's build it. Let's do it here. And haja. Don't pack the soil too tight now. You'll choke the seedlings. Oh, hello, Thomas. I didn't hear you. That's because I don't wear big, clumpy boots like you city folk. Anyway. <clears throat> Not a bad effort for your first plot. Wow, you give compliments? Don't make me regret bringing these for you. 
<laughs> Thank you. But what's the occasion? Hazel's a good woman. Strong. But you don't need me to tell you she's struggling. So when I saw you out helping with the garden beds, well, she's not the only one who appreciates it. I'll do my best with these seeds. Let's go. Got some more seeds. Let's see. Do I need to do two? Three. Sheesh. You know, I'm, I'm going to create another compost. Hey, yo. Actually, I'm going to turn this one. What way is it? Like that? Let's see. Yep. That's the way I want it. Okay. Eesh. Do I have any of that restorative tea? Mushroom apple pie? Where do you get the apple pie from? Uh, apple pie does wonders. Let's eat some of this. Just because I want to go fishing. Let's go. You guys can actually fish here too, look. I don't know if you can now, but later on you can fish here. Let's do worms since there's only small fish here. Actually, let's get that recipe there. I usually don't get recipes. I get the fish instead. But later on, you get, like, towards the end, you need to have a recipe unlocked and... It takes forever. I found something. <laughs> Loco moco. Nice. Hmm, let's do a worm. Let's go. And then you can only fish a certain amount of times and it tells you to stop or something like that. Oh, we need to go see the Farseer. That's right. Tell that, that you've made a desk. All right, we'll go. We'll go. We'll head over like around uh, 8 p.m. From the beach. Let's, let's go fish over here. Oh, no fish there for now. <clears throat> hey actually we should start heading down because we are not going to uh we're not gonna make it so we're gonna go see the farseer uh once we see him and he gives us the stuff we're gonna call it a day for today on the streaming um, and then we will get a next part some other day. What is this guy doing out here? So I will be uh, uploading this to uh, YT. And it's JP Cool Real. Uh, the link can be found underneath, I believe. If not, I'll, I'll put it afterwards on a comment or something. <clears throat> I don't know why I like coming this way. There you go. Let's forage. Yeah, it was a good it was a good choice to come at this time. I'm not gonna lie. Let's get some wood.
have walked you through the tricky bits. This here will explain the extra bits you need. Once you have them, go and write it at your newly made desk. Technically, this isn't an incantation. This is just a piece of paper with some mumbo jumbo on it. Well, then what's the difference? When you go home and write this on your freshly pressed paper, hold the offering in your other hand. That's your thistle. You must concentrate on every word as you write it. You'll know it's working if, as you finish, the offering has vanished and you feel some of your magic is drained away. Then, the page you've created will be an incantation. You should take it to the High Priestess when it's ready. What does this incantation do? That's not for me to discuss. Let's go. Hooray, a new incantation. Let's, let's go. See the Farseer will do the incantation and we'll call it a day. So if you guys are liking this or like to see what I'm doing here, just go ahead and uh, hit that follow. Um, hit that like and we should be good. We should be good. Let's go. Come on, it's already 11 p.m. Come on, come on. Let's see. Here's my desk. I need the ink, okay. Let's do the ink. Let's do the mumbo jumbo. Tell the farseer you created the incantation, right? All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So I'm gonna Time go to sleep. Bed. I'm gonna save it. It's not a saving type of game because it does it automatically, but. There it is. Uh, let me see. Let me see. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm ending it now, like I said. I just want to go ahead and see if I can uh, insert an actual, uh, what is that thing called? <clears throat> A link or something on here, you guys. I usually can. But sometimes it, it's a little tricky on my end. Well, actually, I'll, I'll put it on here. Well, like I said, youtube.com slash uh, JP Uh That should be my handle. So, um, so yeah, thank you for coming by, you guys. Thank you for uh, stopping by, whoever. I know a couple people stopped by because I can see you here. Um, thank you for your time and effort. Uh, I like going here and return to menu just to save it. And we'll call it a day, you guys. Thank you for coming by. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.